You're watching a special episode of Being Fat Sucks on Thanksgiving. What up, brother? Gobble, gobble, gobble. Right? <laughs> Damn, you look awesome, dude. How many pounds you lost? Well, it's like over 20 pounds so far. And what, two months? Oh, yeah, yeah. Man, mine right body tight, man. Well, it's getting there. You know, it's weird. I look at the show myself. Yeah, I do. And, uh, <laughs> and actually, it, maybe I was like, it had blinders on before, but now I look fatter to myself than I did before. <laughs> and I'm like, before I'm like, I saw a prince, and now I see like this, so I'm just motivated to like take it more and more and more. Now you told me the other day on the phone you had a funny story about picking up your dog's uh, <laughs> poop, so to speak. I don't know how else to say it in a nicer way. So tell tell the audience a little bit about that. It's just like one of those little benefits because I mean I've been watching. And I see it's like okay, there's still something here, but the difference is there's that moment. You know, you get your little bag, you get your dog, and you got to bend all the way down. Before I would have to bend over. I. Not that I would have to hold my breath, I couldn't even breathe. I, I like just, and you know, you have to take it all the way down, and now I can inhale, like, you know, right. when I'm bent over. And so, I mean, even though I'm still carrying something, right. it's a noticeable difference in my daily life. Absolutely, you had a, you know, 40 pound baby, now it's down to like an 18 pound baby, <laughs> which is about close to the weight you gotta lose. I mean, you keep on, you're like a machine, man. You're in better shape, you look better, your face is slimmer. I can see I mean, keep bit, it up, yeah. you're gonna look better than Snape, dude. Right? <laughs> Just saying. Now, today we're gonna be doing a special on Thanksgiving. But before we start, Martin, did you know that there was a study in Oklahoma University that they did on average people and they gained one pound during Thanksgiving? Well, that doesn't surprise me at all. Right? Yeah. But let me freak you out a little bit more. They did a study at Tufts University on overweight people, and they gained an average of five pounds or more. So you, buddy, need to stay out of the kitchen and eating these typical highly saturated fats, carbohydrates, the list goes on. But that's why I'm here to show you some goodies. It's like if you're, it's like busting us, if it was like, hey, it's already, I'm already big, so it's like Pow. You're gonna go over the ledge. Yeah. It's like a drug addict, think about it. They mm -hmm. usually start with cigarettes, then they move on to marijuana. Then they're like, well, marijuana is not doing it. Let me just go to cocaine, ecstasy, maybe acid. And then Snickers. <laughs> trust, trust me, guys, this is not a drug-related show, but food and overeating is addicting and it is a drug. Now, back to our regular reporting. <laughs> <laughs> now, look, the holidays are here. Thanksgiving's coming up. We all want to eat everything that's on the table. Why? We're around our family, our peers, our friends. Mm -hmm. We're in an awesome, happy time. Now, why eat anything that's on the table when you can prepare some healthy choices ahead of time? See, that's thinking ahead, and I've been guilty. It's like, here's everything. And right. then, so okay, yeah, let's do it. Now today, Warren, I'm going to be giving you a nice little test comparing mashed cauliflower with regular mashed potatoes. Mm -hmm. You're gonna give me your honest opinion, no acting involved. Break it down and shake it down. So, let's go ahead, turn around, here we go. Okay, let's slowly turn around, and we're gonna flip you, go a little <laughs> circle, then we're gonna go another circle. All right, I'm gonna hand you one spoon to your right hand, all right, and you're gonna tell me what you think of the flavor and then what you think it is. Here we go. Mm -hmm. Three, two. I'm pretty certain that's cauliflower, <clears throat> but it tastes awesome. I love it. I mean, it's it's a little bit more bumpy than I expected. And, and what I think, I mean, I'm certain that's cauliflower, bumpy. but it has a little bumpy thing, but in a good way. I really, really love it. Okay, great. Mm -hmm. And the next one. No, I'm just playing. <laughs> no, we're gonna put it in your right hand <laughs> and try this out. <laughs> and that is? I mean, I'm certain that's potatoes. Okay. It's smoother tasting. I mean, it's smoother feeling. And um, I mean, what can I say? They're both good. I mean, I mean, I love the cauliflower just as much as the potatoes. Right. Well, you're 100% right. Mm -hmm. Now, be real, be honest. Tell me, tell the world, what do you like better? Be honest. I, I like them both, I really do. I mean. How about this, let me just pause you right here and let me tell the world at the same time. Mm -hmm. And you know, I don't wanna, you know, 
kind of like, you know, it's like the, the <laughs> drug dealer is saying, well, this is better because it's cheaper. But here's the real truth, guys. Cauliflower has 37 calories per serving. Mashed potatoes, 400 calories. Are you kidding me? 400? Serving. Yeah. And 37? So I'm not trying to, you know, just saying. No, it has the same uh, same basic effect. It's like a like a mashed up vegetable. It's and it tastes really awesome. Absolutely, I love it. So tell me, I, tell, tell the world, what do you like better? Okay. Keep it real. I like the cauliflower better. <laughs> That's what I'm talking the about. The cauliflower is much better. You just not only you were honest, but you made me happy because <laughs> Martin just you know he's lost 21 pounds, going on two months. You keep on losing. Thanksgiving is coming up, guys. It is, it is. He's not gaining any more weight. If anything, he's gonna be losing. That's what I want. How awesome, you know, the average person gains a pound, you know, during the holidays. How awesome would he be if after Thanksgiving you come back and you're like, Jason, I lost a pound. That's exactly what I want to do right and, there. And that's, that, I'm loving the attitude. Mm -hmm. Now the best part, making mashed cauliflower is so easy to do. Because I get a lot of emails and comments, and just in today's society, especially in Americans, people are not eating enough vegetables. This does not take long to make, and I'm gonna show you and you guys at home how to make this really quick. So, here we go. Making mashed cauliflower is so easy. All it takes is 20 minutes, you steam it. But now, let me actually really show you how you break it down and shake it down. We're gonna grab a potato masher. And as you see, all of our cauliflower has already been steamed. So place it right in the middle and slowly start mashing it little by little. Get a little workout at it too, you know what I mean? A lot of people work out in different ways. You can work out while you're cooking. A lot of people use the shake weight, you know, they go really fast. This is actually a better workout. We're actually burning about 10 to 15 calories a minute just by doing this. Already, as you can tell, it's been less than a minute and it's already halfway done. That's pretty amazing. All right, so we're gonna keep on going. You know, during the holidays, it's so easy because everyone's excited. You got your family around, wife, kids. Oh my God, you know, let's eat. And you know, mashed potatoes are so common for so many generations. But hello, one serving of cauliflower is 37 calories versus mashed potatoes is almost 400 calories. So you do the math. All right. Now, as you're doing this, a lot of people make the common mistake. They're like, oh my God, well, I don't have time to make this wrong. I use the one, two, three step. So it's basically one, two, three, switch to the other side, one, two, three, one, two, three. This makes doing it so much more quicker than your typical one, two, and hello, you're burning calories. Now our cauliflower is done. You're gonna grab a spoon, grab a plate of course, and we're slowly gonna put some on your plate full serving. All right. Now, anybody can eat this just like this. It's so delicious by itself. But if you wanna make it a little extra caliente, that's the way I do it. We're gonna put a little bit of, I can't believe it's not butter, just one tablespoon. And what we do is, once we have it on our cauliflower, we're gonna go ahead and swivel it around, give it a nice little flavor. Come on, it's the holidays, but just because it's the holidays doesn't mean you don't or you can't have your goodies. Now, my favorite is garlic. We're gonna put a little bit of garlic powder on top of our cauliflower mashed potatoes. So you just put a little bit, just like a little pinch. All right, then we're gonna put a little bit of black pepper Okay, which as you know, speeds up your metabolism. And to spice it up and make it even a little bit more caliente, add a little bit of cayenne pepper into the mix. All right, and then last but not least, we're gonna put a little bit of low sodium salt. Just a pinch, we don't wanna overpower it because cauliflower tastes so good on its own. And by the time you mix a little bit of butter, a little bit of pepper, it's delicious. Now, for you at home, if you don't like it too spicy, let's go ahead and have a little taste first. Watch this. On point, on point. But then again, I like it even a little bit more caliente for those spicy lovers out there. Grab a little bit of hot sauce. I like personally Tabasco, Chipotle. Use it to your, you know, taste buds. 
I usually put about three to four drops. One, two, three, and four. I don't just eat it right away. I go ahead again and mix it. All right, it's the holidays, have fun here. Good quality foods, good healthy foods don't have to be bland flavored. Spice it up, this has no calories. All right, check it out, ready? Now that is what I'm talking about. All right, so here we have it. Cauliflower mashed potatoes, only 37 calories per serving. If you wanna add a little bit more flavor, you're gonna put a little bit of low sodium salt, black pepper, cayenne pepper, garlic powder, and just one teaspoon of I can't believe it's not butter. And like I said, you like it a little extra caliente? Just add a few drops of hot sauce. Believe me, it'll take your meal to a whole nother level while keeping your mind right and your body tight. In addition to the low calories that cauliflower gives you, let's talk about the healthy benefits. Check this out. Now we have five healthy benefits with cauliflower. The first one, antioxidation, vitamin C. Who wants to get a cold? Eating cauliflower prevents that. Right away we go into anti-inflammation. Has vitamin K and omega-3. This is awesome. You can get that from eating a lot of salads, different veggies. But why do that when you can have mashed cauliflower? Keep it caliente, right? It also has cardiovascular benefits, which is excellent for blood flow. It also has dietary fiber, which enhances your digestive system. And it also has vitamins B1, B2, B3, B5, B6, B9, which helps balance all the systems in your body. Now, if it's for Thanksgiving or any day during the week, Martin, you can make this awesome mashed cauliflower. It is healthy, it's a vegetable, has tons of antioxidants, vitamins, the list goes on. Now, remember, mind right, Ow. body, <laughs> tight. Subscribe to the channel, Being Fat Sucks. Follow me on Twitter, Jason Roselle Live. Guys, well there's a will, there's a way. Martin's already lost 21 pounds. He's not even full done yet. He's got more pounds to go and we keep on getting low, low, low. I'll see you guys, much love.